Hello folks, it's me, the old Deplorable Basque is here. And, uh, well, this video is for all you dear transgender people and trans activists out there. Now, I want to, I want to say to you something, this is very important. BuzzFeed is not pro-trans. I'm not pro-trans, I'm not criticizing them for that. Uh, I'm pretty sure that, uh, no one could come to my channel and come up with the idea that I am pro-trans. That's, um, uh, I'm pretty sure that, um, uh, that's clear. It's clear because I'm open and honest about my opinions. Or at least I try to be. You know, I'm an imperfect human being. Um, I try to be open and honest and consistent in what I say, in the positions I hold, the arguments that I make. People at BuzzFeed are not. Now... Uh, this video is uh, talking about specifically about people at BuzzFeed and trans issues. Um, for a very long time, the folks at BuzzFeed have been very pro-trans, or at least claimed to be very pro-trans, pushing for um, trans issues, attacking people who are not pro-trans, um, Except, this is a big caveat, except when it comes to people who are conservative. For example, uh, Laura Southern, who had her gender legally changed to male. BuzzFeed has been not good to her on that issue. And most recently, Barry O'Sullivan, who is a conservative politician from Australia. And uh, his story is uh, the reason for this video, in fact. Um... Barry O'Sullivan, uh, who has been a man for just about his entire life, uh, announced that he is now a woman. Um, and ah uh, wants to be referred to as such. I use the word ah, uh, A-H, it's an old Scotch word, uh, third person, singular personal pronoun, non-gender specific. It's a very useful word. Um, but BuzzFeed has attacked ah, uh, saying that Ah uh, is a liar and is just not really trans and is just making some stunt to try to score points off the left. In all honesty, I can't say that they're not right in that because, well, I think they are, but this is a hypocritical because BuzzFeed, people at BuzzFeed, as as individuals, as an organization, have for a very long time pushed the idea that a person who says that they are trans must be taken at face value. A person who has transitioned from man to woman or woman to man or any other gender they come up with must be treated as being the gender that they say they are. This has been BuzzFeed's position, both the people there and as an organization has been their position for a very long time. And now they have decided that they can say who is really trans and who is not. They have decided that they can decide whether a person is actually the gender that they say they are. This is hypocrisy. And I take this as evidence that they're not actually really pro-trans. Because it's not consistent. It's not honest. Now, if you are pro-trans, I have no problem with you being pro-trans. I have no problem with you pushing for laws that you feel should be passed or social changes that you want to see happen, as long as you conduct yourself like an honest and honorable human being. Now, there are hypocrites on the right. I have no illusions about that. And when I know someone is a hypocrite, I try to distance myself from them. I don't want to be associated with hypocrites. Um, so, let's all unite. Let's all... People, let's all honest and honorable people unite to push away the, these hypocrites who I'm sure none of us actually like, but I'm sure are 
a small minority of people on whatever side of political issue there is. I'm sure the majority of people on both sides of our political divide are honest and honorable people. So let's try to dissociate from the crazies, the far out hypocrites who just, they just like to use us, to use our issues to help themselves because that's really what an awful lot of this is. And you know that? That's all I got to say. That's my message. Thank you for watching. Please comment below with anything you have to say. I'd really like to know what you think. Especially if you are pro-trans, please comment below. I like I'd like to have a debate, have an, a conversation. And that's that's really all. Have a good night and God bless.